Hey Sunshines, it's Christy and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I'm so glad that you're here. Milo's going to hang out in the background with us. And for today's video, I have my fashion box for the month of April to share with you. Now, I got this particular shirt, which I think is so pretty. It's a little bit different. You guys know I have a little bit of a different style, but the color is great on my complexion, and it came in my March fashion box. I gotta say, out of all the clothing boxes right now, fashion seems to be getting it. They get that we still wanna be comfortable. We're kind of still in that loungewear mode, but we also wanna be fashionable. We're starting to dip our toe in the outside world as people people are getting vaccinated and we just want to up our game. So we still want to be comfy, but we want to be fashionable. And I think this was the perfect piece for me last month. It's just this light waffle knit. So super comfortable. I can dress it up or down and I just love it. So we're going to go ahead and open it. As a matter of fact, I just watched a uh, sub box lover. Do you watch her? She's fabulous. She just opened her fashion box and got the cutest dress for her. She just lit up when she tried it on and I love watching unboxings where people are excited about what they get and I feel like fashion is it. So if you don't know about fashion, they are a styling service. They're not a subscription box. Basically what that means is you're not going to get the box automatically sent to you every month. You have to go in and order a box every time you want it. It's a $20 styling fee and if you buy one or more pieces in the box, they're going to give you that $20 styling fee back. If you buy three or four, they're going to give you a 20 percent off and if you buy all five they are going to give you a 30 percent discount which is pretty darn incredible i think the last box i ended up buying three pieces it's almost with that discount like getting the third piece almost free with that discount which is really really nice i do have a discount code to get your well it's not a discount code it's a code to get twenty dollars off your first box i guess that's a discount code anyway um i will link that down below if you've never tried fashion before and they typically send you five pieces you fill out a profile um the stylist just asks you what kind of things you like and with fashion you can also set up a zoom call if you want um to just do a little face to face with one of the stylists so she sees you she sees your complexion um you can maybe hold up things in your closet that you like or show them things on your pinterest page it's only like 15 minutes so I do think a lot of people are having better luck when they're doing those zoom calls so you may want to think about that too okay so this is what the box looks like um your genius unboxer actually slit the tape and slit the tape upside down so there you go if you happen to be stopping by for the first time and you love what you see I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up I really really appreciate when you guys do that it really means the world and does wonders for my channel okay so since this is upside down let me flip it back up here all right so this is ooh, i love a good paisley look at the colors this color is totally my color and so is that one okay this is kind of exciting so in the box you get an envelope and there's a couple things in the envelope um there's a little invoice sheet that tells you um everything that's in your box but what i love about this one is it will tell you if you buy three or four pieces what the 25 percent discount is if you buy all five what the 30 percent discount is and then what the piece is if you just buy a single piece and then this kind of gives you all of the information they also send you a uh self-addressed stamped envelope so you can send back anything that you don't like or don't want and i'm gonna go ahead and open my invoice here and see what my stylist said it said hey christy we always are so happy to see you back with us again keeping the weather change in georgia for the next few months i have added a mixture of styles that have a cool mom feel with edgier tops the just black hem destruction skinny pants are the perfect transitional piece i felt um, you should try especially paired with the paper moon daisy rib top and the cute white sneakers I have cute white sneakers, so I'm excited about that. These jeans also work to create an edgier look with the white birch rose long sleeve knit top and either black pumps or studded flats. It's so perfect for date night. I also loved, what I also love most about these jeans, so she's really talking up these jeans, I'm excited, <laughs> um, is they work beautifully in carrying you through summer as well, especially when paired with bright breezy look from the Natural Life Micro Model tank top which could give you a layered look under the Lay Ami Annika Paisley kimono. Oh, I bet that Paisley, yeah, Paisley. She just said Paisley. If I would listen to what I read, I was going to say, I bet that piece that I saw that was Paisley is a kimono. That's what it is. I'm um, just throwing some cute sandals and you have a fun, cool mom, summer chic vibe. Can't wait to hear what you think, Tanya. Tanya's been um, styling me and she's been doing a really, really good job. Okay, looks like this. Ooh, okay. I don't have a kimono this color. 
And one of my kimonos from last season is actually like a nude kimono in a tie dye from Fashion. It was my favorite piece last summer. So they actually went ahead and put the tank under this, but this is that natural life little tank in coral, which she actually safety pinned the two together. How cute is that? So when I pulled them up, I would be able to see. So this is just a little tank top. Very cute, I love this color for summer, isn't it? And I got that really cute purse in my Good Vibe Scribe that would look so cute paired with this. Okay, so that little tank top is The Natural Life, which is a fabulous brand. It's all like organic cotton and sustainable, I believe. And it's $33, okay? And then here's the little kimono, which I love. You guys know I love a kimono moment. I just love them because you still look chic in them, uh, but if you are just feeling a little bloated or you just feel like your hiney's not looking the best that day, you put a kimono on and you just elevate your look so nicely. And if you put just a little tank top under, it doesn't really feel like you've layered that much. Every time I wear a kimono, any kimono, I always get compliments. Little old men, ladies, young girls, people at the counter, um, they, you just get noticed. Not that you always want to be noticed, but this is really cute. So I love that. All right, and it says that that guy is the Leia Me Annika Paisley kimono for $42. I will go ahead and put the link for um, the $20 off your first box if you want to at the top of the description box, and then I will list all of the clothing in this box in case you want to request something. They don't always have everything. Sometimes inventory moves quickly, but at least maybe they can give you something similar, or if they have that particular item in style, they can a stock, they can send it to you. Okay, look at this. Okay, this is long sleeved, um, but I'm liking the edginess of it. I think this is the way it goes. So cute. I wish it was short sleeved and not long sleeved, but I feel like it's been colder here. Believe it or not, we've had some cold snaps, like super cold. I've had to put my sweaters and sweatshirts back on. So I do think I can wear this into the spring, but it's gonna be perfect to pull back out and feel almost brand new for fall. So I'm actually not mad that they sent this. And you guys know I love a good little edgy moment. I think on camera sometimes when you have something interesting, it just is fun to wear. I like this a lot. Okay, so this is the White Birch Rose Long Sleeve Solid Knit Top for $42. I hope that it's not too clingy in the stomach. I love the color though. Okay, all right, here's the jeans that she was going on and on about and I super hope that they fit. These are by Just Black. They are size 29. They do have um, a raw edge hem. Uh, not quite a shark bite, but they almost look like a shark bite. I feel like a shark bite usually goes up a little bit further. Maybe a baby shark bite. <laughs> um, and these are, I think they said they were skinnies. Now, a lot of times with skinnies, I have to go up a size in white jeans for some reason. But we'll see what we think about these. Just black is made in the US, which is a nice brand. And those jeans are $76. But I need a pair of white jeans, so I'm happy for and that. And last but not least, ooh, this is cute. Look at this. It's very similar to the color that I have on. I'm loving these sort of neutral muted colors. Um, creams and these browns and neutrals and this kind of darker peach. It's so pretty. This is by Paper Moon. Unfortunately, it's, oh, yeah, I just decided I don't like it. Unfortunately, it's long sleeve. She did say she got the weather in Georgia, but it's going to be like 80 degrees probably next week. Um, but this makes it a no. Why? Why, 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 Paper Moon? No, no, no. This this just cheapens it. I feel like I don't like this at all. Darn. Okay. So this is probably going to be a no. This is the only piece that I really just don't like. Everything else I do. So let's go ahead and do the try on and I will be right back. All right, so I have on this first top, which had potential. It really did. I loved the color. I love a good stripe, but my eye goes straight to this applique. I, I, I just don't think, I just don't think it's me. A lot of you will think it's cute and that is okay. My style doesn't have to be your style at all. Um, I don't think it's a bad shirt. I just don't think it's a me shirt. So this is going to be a no. I forgot to tell you the price though. This shirt would normally be $42 if you just bought it individually. So again, not bad, 
just not me. And I also forgot to tell you, every time I wear these earrings, I get so many questions. They're from Target, so I will link them down below for you. So this first top is going to be a no. All right, so next I decided to try on this little kimono moment with the tank top, super cute. I just paired it with some rolled up boyfriend jeans. You can throw in a really cute sandal, a dressy or flip flop, or even just a little slip on sneaker and you're good to go. So I do love the kimono, but I don't love, <clears throat> excuse me, the big long slit up the side some longer kimonos have this and some don't i tend to prefer the ones that don't but i understand why it has it it just helps it with its cute movement i love the length of the arms too they're kind of a three-quarter it's adorable i love the colors i love the pattern and then here's the little tank i'm going to pull it out so you can kind of see the length so it is thin you can see the waistband of my jeans sort of through it but what is done so well with this tank is how high it comes under the arm this company gets it because if you're a woman it's a little bit older some of us have you know this stuff right here <laughs> and when they cut them so low it you see all that nobody wants to show that so i love the cut of this i typically like a tank top that is a little bit flowier um i think if i got this i would go up a size if I'm being honest, I know why they sent this bright coral to go with this, but it, to me, it kind of fights the color. I know the colors through it, but I might play with a more muted coral or a white or cream to go under it. Maybe. Uh, I also would put just a long fun necklace on with it. Y'all know I love a good Mrs. Roper moment. So I think if I can exchange the tank top and go up one size, I'm going to keep both of these pieces. All right, let's keep going. All right, y'all know I'm going to love this top, right? <laughs> I love all the interesting necklines. I love the color of this. This is so my color. It is adorable. I do think that I can wear this a while for spring on camera. And then, like I said, it'll feel like a brand new piece when I pull it out for the fall. So this is definitely a piece I'm going to keep. It's not too fitted around the stomach. It might look like it because these jeans are so tight, you guys. She sent me skinny jeans and she sent my size which may sound like the right thing to do, but typically for white skinny jeans, a stylist should know to size up. Y'all, these are so tight that like you can see my C-section scar. There's nothing left to the imagination. They are so bunchy. They are so tight. You can see everything. And I do think these are definitely a no. They just look like I'm a sausage cased in lining. <laughs> Um, it, it's just the facts. So these are going to be a no, which is a bummer, total bummer. Maybe if they were up one size, they might work, but I'm not going to try and exchange them in hopes that they would. But honestly, if you can see literally my C-section scar, the bump of it, that's, that's not okay. So that's going to be a no, but the shirt is going to be a yes. So I think I'm done. Stay tuned and I will be right back for the recap. Hang on. All right, guys, so I think they did a great job. I think overall I'm going to buy three pieces. The tank top, I am going to try and size up one size in it if I can. The kimono, I don't think I'm going to wear those two pieces together. I don't think. I might. I might change my mind. Um, but I know that I will wear them separately, and I loved that maroon shirt. Bummer on the jeans. I just feel like a stylist should know to go up a size in skinny jeans um, because it was like pushing up my muffin top. I had like a line. It was not... <laughs> was not a good moment. I think this week, honestly, I'm going to Nordstrom and I'm going to try on every pair of white jeans I can get my hands on until I can find the perfect pair because I'm just struggling with finding one and I want a pair of really cute white jeans. It's spring break here, so I'll have a little bit of time. And then I really liked the striped top. I just didn't like the applique. Just a Christy thing. It's There's nothing wrong with it. I loved the colors of it. If that's your vibe, I think it's adorable. Um, but that's what I've decided to do. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please, please, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you soon for another one. Bye-bye.